right, let's just take a look at one last comment by this person. What the hell is wrong with you people? Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, welcome back to another video. Once again, certain human beings have disappointed and showed just why they don't deserve to be human beings on this planet. Today we're talking about Farah Ann. Now Farah Ann is a Malaysian gymnast and she just got into the 2020 Olympics. Now what you would expect from normal Malaysians is to be happy about this. And don't get me wrong, so many people are happy about this. But, 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 with every good thing, there's always certain people who are focusing on the bad things. There's always the small group of people who have the negative mindset and just cannot see the positive in any situation like our Malaysian athlete just qualified herself for the Olympics and yet there's people who are so negative about this situation and the thing that they are complaining about it's so irrelevant do you guys know what people are complaining about yes you guys guessed it people are complaining about her clothes she's a gymnast all gymnasts wear clothes like this I don't even understand how people can focus on her clothes when she just qualified herself for the Olympics oh and if any of you are wondering if I'm making this up let me just show you so you guys know that I'm not lying about this all right so Astro has put up a post on Farah and and the people who commented here look at this this first person this person told her to change sports her talent is being a gymnast and you want her to change sports just because of how she dresses up and some of you are probably like hey Mahesh this person did not even talk about the clothes why are you assuming okay okay maybe I am assuming that this person is talking about the clothes and that's why they want her to change sports okay now this comment you guys can clearly see is talking about her clothes and the suggestion is to provide clothes that are not so revealing the problem is people who are gymnasts they need to move a lot and in order to move a lot, you need to be flexible enough to move a lot. And if you cover yourself with clothes, you probably can't move. And that's the reason why gymnasts wear clothes like this. It's at a point where her clothes are not the problem. But your mindset of the situation is. Why can't you just let her wear what gymnasts usually wear? Alright, let's just take a look at one last comment by this person. What the hell is wrong with you people? Farah N just got into the Olympics. Why can't you just congratulate her and shut up? For those of you who at this point of the video still think there is something wrong with her clothing, I'm telling you now, there is nothing wrong with her clothing. I'll even prove it to you. Let's go to Google and check what gymnasts usually wear. Gymnastic outfits. Okay, I mean look at that. It's already showing that um, I mean look at this guys, every single person on this list, every single one of them is wearing exactly what Farah Ann is wearing. And that means there is nothing wrong with what Farah Ann is wearing. So for those of you who are focusing on the clothes rather than focusing on a win, you guys gotta change your mindset. And you guys should actually focus on what is really important. Which in this situation is Farah and getting into the Olympics. It's the Olympics. And you guys are going online and your keyboard and complaining about clothing. Oh my god. It's simple. If you guys cannot appreciate her being the talented person that she is, just sit down, shut up and don't say anything. And yeah guys, that's it for today's video. If you guys want to support my channel, don't forget to subscribe. Go and like this video if you guys think there is absolutely nothing wrong with what Farah and is wearing. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.